Welcome to Power Coat Music. In this presentation, we're going to do a quick overview of the Fender Studio Digital Audio Workstation software application. Before we dive in, I want to quickly ask you to please check out my YouTube homepage to view all of my videos carefully organized by subject. Also, if you find you like this video, please like and subscribe. You see, it really helps out the channel a great deal and allows us to keep doing what we are doing. And now, back to the presentation. Fender Studio is a free digital audio workstation or DAW that was launched in May of 2025 by Fender. This marks the company's jump into the music production software arena. Then the software is designed with a focus on simplicity and accessibility. It caters primarily to guitarists and other types of musicians seeking a more intuitive platform for recording and editing audio. Now this is important. If you've been worn out and frustrated dealing with the feature complexities and subscription fees of many DAW applications that are available, and you just want to record your music on your PC, Mac, or phone with significant ease, then the Fender Studio could be a game changer for you. It may also be a good starting point for those who are new to DAWs. Now here's the deal. You can download and install Fender Studio on your Mac or Android mobile phone and also on Windows, Mac, or Linux computer platforms all for free. The download link is on your screen now and also in the description of this presentation below. I installed the application on my Windows PC in my studio and so far I enjoy it because it's so simple. For mobile phone users, well, Fender released a small audio interface unit called Link.io that allows users to connect instruments or microphones for recording, although you don't need it. You can still use your phone's mic. It also includes a headphone input for monitoring. Now, this item is sold separately. When I invoke the software on my Windows PC, I click the three lines in the top right corner of the screen. I select Audio Setup and then select my USB audio interface. Since all audio signals are recorded and played back through that unit, I'm good to go. Let's check out some of the pros of the Fender Studio DAW software. The user interface emphasizes ease of use, featuring a one-tap recording function that allows users to start recording immediately upon launching the app. This streamlined approach is great for capturing spontaneous musical ideas without the need for complex setup procedures. And this works the same way on the computer platforms. The software may be designed for guitarists, but it's still, you know, a basic recording platform, which means you can record your synths, live drums, drum machines, saxophones, vocals, and much more. You can even use the software on your mobile phone for capturing samples of your music when you're on the go. The DAW software supports up to eight audio tracks in its base version, which is usually fine for creating demos and simple compositions. Users who register for a free Fender Connect account can unlock additional features, including up to 16 tracks along with MP3 export capabilities and access to extra amp models and effects. A standout feature of Fender Studio is its inclusion of fairly authentic Fender amplifier simulations and effects for guitars. The base version offers models such as the 65 Twin Reverb and the Rumble 800, uh, V3 amps along with essential effects like overdrive, chorus, delay, and reverb. Upon registering, users gain access to additional amp models, including the 59 Basement and Supersonic, some of my favorites, as well as effects like fuzz, flanger, and various reverb types. Fender Studio 
includes 20 professionally recorded jam tracks across genres from pop to metal. These tracks are fully editable, allowing users to mute or solo individual instruments, adjust the tempo, and transpose keys. Such features are particularly useful for practicing and enabling musicians to play along with backing tracks and focus on specific sections or instruments. The application offers a suite of audio editing tools, including things like compression, equalization, reverb, and delay. Additionally, it provides vocal effects like detuning, vocoder, and ring modulation, which I think is pretty cool. While the features or pros cover basic mixing needs, some of the cons are that Fender Studio currently lacks MIDI support and third-party plugin and integration, which may limit its uh, utility for users requiring advanced production capabilities. Also, the DAW is limited to a maximum of 16 tracks when users register with Fender to unlock this upgrade. While this could be a deal breaker for some, others will have no problem nailing their productions with 16 tracks or less. In summary, Fender Studio represents a strategic move by Fender to provide an accessible and user-friendly recording solution tailored to guitarists and musicians seeking a straightforward platform for capturing musical ideas. Its integration of Fender tones and ease of use and compatibility across multiple devices could make it a valuable tool for beginners and those looking for a quick and efficient way to record and practice music. Well, that's a wrap. If you like this presentation, please give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button to join our group. You see, we have new presentations coming out every 7 to 14 days and leave a comment about this content in the comment section below. Check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, and TikTok. Now, while you're here, check out some of the music videos and playlists because they're designed just for you. Thanks so much for watching. We really do appreciate it and we look forward to seeing you soon.